there is something super attractive about gray felines. Whether they're purebred or just your average feline, gray cats are a favorite among many. While we might see more tabbies, tuxedos, and black cats, gray kitties hold a special spot in the hearts of many cat lovers worldwide. Keep watching to learn some fun and interesting facts about gray cats. Gray cats are not actually that rare. Gray cats can come in a few coat varieties. Obviously, there can be long hair or short hair, but they can also have tabby stripes on them or even white, especially on their paws. Also referred to as blue, gray cats are simply a diluted version of black cats in terms of coat color. This is why you can also see torties and calicos with gray rather than black in their coat patterns. Have you ever wondered why gray cats are often referred to as blue? Well, this is because their dilute coat has a faint blue hue to it. While the Russian blue might be most popular, there are a few breeds of gray cats. When you think of a solid gray feline, typically a Russian blue cat comes to mind. Here's one of my favorite Russian blue cats, Teeny Dina. But there are a few breeds that are known for their dazzling gray coats. The British short hair can come in a variety of coat patterns and colors, but they are most recognized for their piercing orange eyes and British blue gray coat. But when it comes to cats that are exclusively blue like the Russian blue, there's also the Nibelung, a cat which very much resembles a long-haired version of a Russian blue cat. Their name literally translates to creature of the mist in German for the way as if it appears that their majestic coat is just floating delicately over their body. The Korat of Thailand is another cat breed that is exclusively gray in color. And lastly, the Chartreux of France is another popular cat breed which is known for their gray coat. Interesting little Russian blue cat coat fact for you. Despite all that pretty gray all over their bodies, a purebred Russian blue cat will have pink paw pads. But remember, although those cats I just mentioned are specifically known for their gray coats, gray cats can be mixed bred or found in several other purebred cat breeds, such as the Oriental Shorthair, Persian, and the American Shorthair. So, if you have your heart set on a gray cat, just visit your local shelter. There's a very good chance that you'll find one. Gray tuxedo cats are known for their catitude, just like black and white tuxedo cats. I've read a few stories about gray cats that had white tuxedo markings that were not afraid to display their catitude in full force. For one gray tuxedo cat named Admiral Galacticat, well, he is a bit of a kleptomaniac, and he likes to round up his loot, which is his neighbor's laundry, and bring it home to show off to his humans. In addition to this naughty feline, when it comes to cats which are most likely to display catitude, one study out of the UK found that gray and white tuxedo cats fell a close second to the traditional black and white tuxedo cats when it came to flexing their catitude on their humans. Does this surprise you? I know I'm not surprised one bit. But when it comes to solid gray cats, there are a few studies which indicate that these lovely cats are known for being sweet-natured and devoted to their humans. I'm sure that gray tuxedo cats can be this way too, but on their terms. Now that you've learned all about gray cats, stay tuned to the next video from the Catitude Babel YouTube channel to learn all about those cool mini panthers of the cat world. You know you want to.